Sunday from LA. I am on day three of my trip here and I wanted to do a little what eat in a day in LA edition because this trip has been another demonstration of how far I've come in recovery and just being able to be so free with my food choices and feel in the moment and honor all my cravings. It's just something I haven't been able to do and in the past year or so being able to do that and just really enjoy trips and traveling alone again is so amazing and I just want to share a little day in my life in LA as well as all the fun eats I have today. I'm meeting my dad later for lunch so we have a nice little reservation in a place in Venice which I'm excited about. This morning I'm heading to Coffee MCO which is the coffee shop near my friend's apartment that I'm staying at and literally they're almond croissant life-changing so I need to go back and get another one I had it the other day so I'm gonna go there get some work done I have my laptop and romanticize my life at a coffee shop so welcome to a new video and welcome to a day in my life in LA That's my matcha. I got the matcha pistachio from Canyon Coffee with brown sugar. It's so good. doing like work I'm at my friend's apartment. I've just been doing catching up with some emails and stuff for work. But I wanted to do a little very quick mini haul of things I got today while I was out with my dad. So I went to Canyon Coffee where I got the matcha. And I picked up one of their mugs because they're the cutest thing ever. Oh that's really cute. And this is the front. I don't know, I just love how like thick it is. It makes me happy and it will rem remind me of my trip every time I drink out of it. 
And then the other little boutique shop we went to was called Shout and About, I believe, also in Echo Park. They had the like cutest little things, just random little knickknacks and fun house things and candles and cards and I don't know, it was really fun. And I got this little jar, which I have something similar to it, but this one feels more substantial and it has a small straw. My other ones have like a big straw and I love the, the top that comes with it. So it's kind of easier for on the go. It won't spill as easily. And then last but not least is this gorgeous candle. Really cute. It smells so good. A truly sweet grass and it's a soy wax candle. Oh my God. That's my little haul. I am currently waiting for Sam to finish up a little call she has, and then we're gonna go to Earth Cafe for dinner, which I'm very excited. It's been on my list for a long time to go in LA, but I have never been. Gonna get back to doing a little bit of work until she's ready, and then we'll go to dinner. Made it to Earth Cafe. Little din din together. Second to last night. Not that you're not gonna be back. I know, I'll be back. And here I have kale, quinoa, sweet potato, cucumber, and these little pita chip things I've been eating. ice cream trip. I realized Rin Lewins is in LA. Which I also was very unaware of and now I'm yeah. really about time. I'm excited because it's literally my favorite ice cream in New York and then I saw they had spots here so we were like, let's go. 15 minutes till they close. Cool. We're that, pe that people. Oh, they have spring specials. Vegan Planet Earth. Ooh. Ice cream has been secured. I'm putting Sam on to the peanut butter brownie honeycomb. Now I'm gonna be going all the time, especially over the summer. Oh my god. Mm. It's really peanut buttery, but I love it. The thing is, Yay. I'm such a peanut butter girl. I don't like chocolate ice cream, but I like like I. It has to be like another like a vanilla kind of flavor with chocolate chunks in mm -hmm. it. So like I was contemplating the chocolate brownie mm -hmm. there, but I think this balance is perfect because it's mm -hmm. still the vanilla with the brownie pieces I love peanut butter and the too. peanut butter. Oh yeah, and if you get a crunch of the honeycomb, it adds. Ooh. It's good too. Mm -hmm. Also, here to remind you, it's like 11 o'clock. We're just eating ice cream in the car. Two girlies have overcome that annoying voice in our head. Oh yeah. And oh just had to point that. We had to put that out there. Spontaneous. Exactly. 11 p.m. ice cream trips. They're open until 11 p.m. for a reason. Exactly. If we weren't meant to be snacking on ice cream at 11 p.m., they would have closed earlier. Exactly. I love that. <laughs> Someone's gotta get business. This is living. Yes, exactly. We're giving them business and keeping ourselves happy. Oh, yeah. It's a very symbiotic relationship. <laughs> yeah. Cheers. Cheers.